field for tonight's 10th and final race coming out onto the track. Superfecta and Exacta waging with about post time in seven minutes. And Kathy McDonald will bring the field to the post for the Superfecta. Number one is Mileage Unlimited, owned by John Tatham, with a driver change to Elliot Deaton. Number two is Stephanie's Destiny, owned and driven by Rick Jordan Three, Coniat Connie, owned by Robert Hagnier. The driver tonight will be David Hawk. Four, Go Mary Joe, owned by Wesley Helton with Jody Essig. Number five, Winterwood Lace, owned by Carson Holler and Daniel Schwartz. The driver is Calvin Holler. Six seven W owned by Joseph Schwartz and James Spark with Mike Wilder. Seven Pat's Nicole owned by Sue Stetson with Richard Flanders. Number eight is Elma Hurst Scarlet, owned by Dan Wiseman. Driver change to Jeff Fout. Nine Mezzo owned by Glenn Congrove and Cecil Clemens. David Miller will be in the sulky. Six minutes till post time. Go. They're off and pacing. Middle of the racetrack, Winterwood Lace takes the lead. Quickly between horses, Go Mary Joe rushing up on the far outside. Elmahur Scarlet, they're down the back stretch. Mileage Unlimited gets away in four. Stephanie's Destiny fifth. Coney Atkani is in the sixth. Emma W. Pats Nicole in the gray mezzo. As they slug this one out to the quarter mile pole, Winterwood Lace has got the top. Go Mary Joe is in there second. They open up here in a quick 28 and 1. Superfecta Mares are in parade, racing past the stands to the half mile pole. Winterwood Lace cuts this one out. Winterwood Lace on top by two. Go Mary Joe second. Alma Hurst Garwood is third. Mileage Unlimited is fourth. Stephanie's Destiny is up on the outside with Coney Ott County and Emma W along the rail. Pat's Nicole in the gray mezzo around the paddock turn of the half mile pole. Trying to make every pull the winning one, Kelvin Heller and Winterwood Lace, 58 and one up the back stretch. Winterwood Lace on top by two. Go Mary Joe, second, Alma Hurst Scarlet is now third. Followed by Milo John Limited in fourth. Stephanie's Destiny can't go on. Here comes Coney Ott County up on the far outside. After that, it's Pat's Nicole, Emma W and the Gray. As they race to three quarters, Go Mary Joe on the outside. Winterwood Lace along the rail. Here's Coney Ott County up on the outside, 128 and 1. Moving around the far turn. Winterwood Lace on top. Go Mary Joe on the outside, second. Coney Ott County, third. Elma Hurst Scarlet is on the rail, fourth as the field straightens away. Winterwood Lace has regained the lead. Go Mary Joe is up on the outside. Late closer still coming. Coney Ott County. The favorite is going to disappoint the chalk players again. Winterwood Lace wire to wire. Go Mary Joe, second. Coney Ott County, third. And seven, Pats Nicole, fourth. Here comes the unofficial winner of tonight's 10th and final race. Number five, Winterwood Lace, a five-year-old bay mare by In the Pocket out of Winterwood. Owned by three-year-old Carson Holler of Toledo, Daniel Schwartz of Perrysburg, rain and trained by Kelvin Holler. Going coast to coast here in 157 and four. Number five, Winterwood Lace, the winner of tonight's 10th and final race. Five four exactum, sixty four dollars and twenty cents. Superfecta forty eight fifty four eighty. Final pick three on one two and five. Three out of three one thousand two hundred twenty three dollars and forty cents. 